Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. This is my 500 hour update video and there's lots to cover in this one. First I want to head over and review the original playlist I was using which is about a year ago now since I started. So the playlist itself isn't all that bad, it's just very beginner friendly. I think I capped out in a lot of these tasks a while back now and I decided that I'm very happy with the results so far. Grid shot for example, every run is over 100k first try but still with a maximum of 132k because I just can't click quicker. So in terms of mapping that back into an actual FPS game for translation, I'd say it's just helped me to navigate around comfortably. In terms of hitting shots though, yeah it's helped in some scenarios, or at least I think so, but obviously there are better tasks suited to improving this like 6 shot or the new Valorant Ascent headshot. I would say getting around 80 or 90 or even 100k is absolutely fine in grid shot to be honest because it's very tough to exercise that same speed in an accuracy based task. On the flip side though, you do get practice hitting shots at those ridiculous speeds. If you're already at that score you'll get more benefit out of other tasks. In summary I would recommend using the original playlist for around 3-6 to six months before moving on to a new one. So apart from just feeling generally better at Valorant, I would say aim-wise I feel like I'm hitting new types of shots, but the consistency has stayed very much the same in the sense that I'm still definitely missing some of them. You can see that I feel very comfortable moving around now, so precision and hitting that headshot first time is my goal for the next 500 hours of training. I'm also hoping to push to Immortal 8k by the end of this act. So for my version 2 playlist I've included a lot more precision based tasks which you can see here. I'll be showing my current run throughs but I don't expect anything great as I need lots of work on this. I see people hitting 120k 6 shot easy and I'm rocking 110k personal best. So this is what I've decided to grind. I'm having trouble uploading this at the moment as it says it's already uploaded but I can't see it. So just take note of the tasks if it's something you want to try. Also, if you want to try an insane warm-up, try Nelko's one. He's a channel sub and it really does put you through it. I know that it's going to take thousands of hours of FPS training to become insane, so for just 500 I think it's gone really well. Considering I also started Plat in Valorant and now I'm showing Immortal, but that's down to gameplay experience too. Anyway, here's the playlist runs. <laughs> Cause I'm the E 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 I don't slang up bang, I just smoke motherfuckers like it ain't no thing Before I wake At least in heaven 
I'll check it. Yo, yo, I hope this beat's flame resistant. When I come off the top, I've lost the plot like books with pages missing. Won't break tradition, I'm keeping it real. Plant seeds of destruction in Elysium fields. Spit heat to combustion, blessing the beat. My peeps are weaving a worldwide web of deceit. And until we rest in peace, not sharing love, be scared of us. We go out on a limb like a pair of gloves. Tearing up vets, shouting abuse. I don't respect my elders, I drown them in the fountain of youth. And I ice pick my brain for rhymes. My frame of mind turns food for thought into migraines of rice. Rhyme asylum, ninja assassin. You're left with anaphylactic shock once I sting into action. Taken under the wing of a dragon. After I was born, the Bible's authors had to print a retraction. We got a nuller instinct, spitting nothing but flames. Nothing has changed. Rappers still got nothing to say. And we dedicated time to perfect the craft. We the chosen few that still respect the art. And we overdue in the vocal booth. We got a nuller instinct. Next, I'd like to give a special thanks to these streamers for playing my map in the AimLab G2 Creator Studio contest. I was selected as runner-up, which honestly made my day. If this is gonna set the bar, I feel like the bar is. Which brings me onto the map I said that I wanted to create in the previous video. So the one above all was going to be a multi-game training ground, basically with every mechanic that you can access by shooting the button for a task. The reason I stopped on this was due to the Valorant event and tasks that came out. I was thinking why am I doing this when I can use the actual maps? Of course the limitation is that not all of the maps are created. But anyway, I was thinking, if I could use Valhaven for example, I could set up teleporters to each of the locations such as A site, B site, and you could train flicking, precision there and move on to another location. But there isn't exactly a way to do this. So it's forced me into just creating separate tasks for each place. Introducing Reese PK Bind V1 Easy. So this is the new task I've created for the next giveaway. As mentioned before, I'm still quite limited to what I can create fully, so the task has set spawns where the bots also have health degeneration. If you kill some of the bots in the existing set, they will spawn the next set so you will have remaining bots from the previous wave as well as new ones. The idea behind this is that if you are extremely talented at aiming, 
then going fast is going to spawn more bots suited to your speed, which would present a challenge for all participants. I was also toying with the idea of a headshot variant, but you can't really use the jet bots that I like to put in because the vertical movement means they sometimes travel downwards behind the box. Also, the dashes onto raised ground messes up the head height because the path just stays in a straight line. So the giveaway is going to be two lots of the Logitech G702 Lightspeed, which is the same mouse I'm using in this video. The winners are going to be the top one placement score in this task in the leaderboard, and one random participant. The close date for the challenge is going to be the 26th of May at 5pm. To enter you must join the channel's Discord using the link in the description below the video. This is still the only way I can validate the entries. So to enter, just simply take a screenshot of your result and post it into the giveaway channel in the server. I will be keeping tab of all the entries to scope out who scores the highest and to select the random winner. Entrance will be promoted to the prize pool role which I will update daily at best so keep your eye on this to make sure you've entered correctly. Also please note that when you join the server, you will first need to select a role which will enable all the other channels. If you have absolutely any questions at all or need any help, post a comment below and I'll get back to you. Next, here's a quick mechanic summary for the challenge. There isn't really much to note other than jet bots and raise bots score higher, so make sure they aren't despawning. Hopefully in the future I can randomise the spawns a bit better in different locations, so future challenges will see better tasks. And as always, many thanks for watching and I wish you the very best of luck in the challenge.